a lot of people won't have the chance to play football after this. So uh, I think that's what hurts me the most, you know, just knowing that, knowing I could have did something better. And uh, coming up short that game, I think that's what hurt the most. It took you about 30 minutes just to get off the field after the game because you wanted to thank everybody and take pictures with everybody. How important was that for you to say goodbye to a lot of the people uh, and say thank you to the fans? Uh, I know a lot of people probably won't see me again unless they just cast me at Cracked. Uh, <laughs> no, nah, a lot of people won't see me again. So, you know, just taking the time out, talk to everybody, take pictures with everybody, sign autographs. You know, that's something I'm, I'm always about. Uh, I don't see myself as like the this big superstar, how they see me. So, uh, whenever somebody want to take a picture, you know, I'm down. Uh, just felt a little rushed, but, you know, I'm always down to just, you know, cool down with people and if they want, if they want a picture or autograph, you know, that's the basic. It'll take like two seconds, so I'm always doing that. Uh, from a lovely late push to get you here to where you are now in All-American, how do you sum up what you've left here, John? Uh, right now, honestly, I don't know yet, you know. I'm still living in it. Uh, I never really looked into the hype, you know. Never looked into like all the awards and the accolades, you know. I'm, I'm always like just living in the now. And uh, it hasn't even hit me now. I just played my last college game. You know, it doesn't feel real. Like I say, I'm, I live in the now. So uh, I'll probably by like next week, it'll probably hit me. Everything will start to hit me. What do you feel like you did here though? Uh, Hopefully, me and Keith uh, and everybody else that's came here changed the perspective of Illinois defense alignment. You know, uh, we made a huge impact these three, four years, you know, uh, with a new coaching staff three years uh, and a new scheme. Uh, just hopefully we, we change perspective of how people see Illinois D-line. Uh, a lot of mistakes, you know, and uh, injuries. Uh, next man up mentality. Uh, I think we had like two or three people that went down out for game. You know, the next guy just has to step up. And, uh, a few mistakes here and there. We got a, a, a lot of young people. Uh, those young players made mistakes, but I mean, they got, they got time to fix them. So I won't say nothing went wrong, just uh, lessons that got to be learned. What do you think about this program moving forward now without you? What do you think the future looks like for them? Uh, for for the program, I feel like that'll be good. Uh, I'm not I'm not too much worried about the drop off. We got some young guys that are that are hungry and that are dominant. Uh, yeah, I feel like I feel like it'll be probably better. You know, uh, as a as a whole defense line unit, it'll be no drop off. Um, not saying there was drop off this year. We had pretty good uh, seconds, but uh, I'm just excited to see our younger guys play. Like we working out together, they're neck and neck with me. And they just got on campus, so I, I love it. You know, you're confident. You, you proved a lot this year, but did, did you prove anything yourself? What do you think you proved this year? Uh, my biggest thing coming back this year was trying to see if I could do the exact same thing I did last year. You know, uh, I accomplished a lot of things last year, and I feel like uh, I did I did more this year. And uh, other than the stats, uh, being a leader to my team, to the younger guys, taking them on my wing. Uh, I feel like that was my biggest accomplishment. How what frustrating you... was this season, though, for you guys, especially defensively, uh, after the last year's success to mm -hmm. not be able to sustain that? Uh, I knew last, from once those guys declared, uh, it was going to be a big difference. You know, first, second, and third round defensive backs. Uh, I don't think you could you could beat that. Um, I want to say it was no disappointment for me. You know, uh, I enjoyed going out there every week, playing with my brothers. You know, the younger guys, helping them along the way. Uh, Keeping them level-headed when they're frustrated. Uh, I know I got more football to play, but um, so it was really never a disappointment for me. Just helping those younger guys learn from the mistakes they made, so they could be better off in the future.